hi guys uh, in this video i am giving you just a brief idea about how to calculate the short circuit current of a pv module using the data sheet so the given data sheet is the uh, vikram solar panel so you can find uh, the pv module with a different voltage rating uh, the first column is uh, the, the details about the 295 watt uh, the pv module and the next one is so 300 watt, uh, 305 watt, 310 watt, 315 watt. So there is a series of uh, different types of uh, PV module of different ratings are available. But I now focus on uh, 295 uh, watt panel. And uh, uh, the short circuit current of this uh, panel is uh, 9.58. And uh, the temperature coefficient, the current temperature coefficient is uh, short circuit uh, current temperature coefficient is 0 0.046 percentage per degree Celsius. I use these two details to find what is the short circuit current of this panel at 40 degree Celsius. This is a shortcut 9.58 is the short circuit current of the panel at 25 degree Celsius. Um, 295 watt panel the short circuit current is uh, 9.58 ampere. This is at uh, standard test condition that is at 25 degrees Celsius and the, the coefficient is of short circuit current alpha I is 0 0.046 percentage per degree Celsius. So alpha I can be expressed as a change in current, the change in the short circuit current that that is upon the short circuit current at 25 degrees Celsius that is multiplies 100 all divided by the change in temperature. So using this expression we can find what is that the change in current delta I S E. So delta I S E can rearrange using this above expression alpha I times the short circuit current at the standard test condition that is 25 degrees Celsius in the change in temperature that's everything is upon 100 so by substituting the value of alpha i and the short circuit current that is 9.58 and change in temperature so at standard test condition the temperature uh, is 25 degrees celsius suppose you need to find what is that uh, short circuit current at 40 degrees celsius the change in temperature is the 15 degrees Celsius. So by substituting all these values into this expression, you can find the, sh the change in short circuit current. So it is found that the change in short circuit current is 0 0.066 amp. So then you can use the short circuit current at 40 degrees Celsius is the short circuit current at the standard test condition plus the change of the short circuit current due to the change of temperatures. So this value is that at 25 degrees Celsius the short circuit current is 9.58 9.58 plus the change in short circuit current due to the change of temperature that is 0 0.066 ampere. 0 0.0 Six six ampere. The the final answer is nine point six four six amperes. This is a short circuit current of this panel at forty degrees Celsius. There is a change the rise of this current point zero six six ampere. So hence the short circuit current of this panel is increased with the increase of the temperatures. So it is very evident from the temperature coefficient that this is a positive temperature coefficient. Its value is positive. That means with the rise of temperature, there is a rise in short circuit currents. So we can use this formula to find out what is the short circuit current of this module at any temperatures. Now try this method to, to identify what is the current at different temperatures.